Holy crap. This honestly is probably like my favorite episode of the entire season. Like that fight was just plain amazing. All Might just versus Nomu or whatever that bird brain muscular monster thing is. Was just pure intense, dude. It was just so hyped. The music was awesome. The animation was awesome. The voice acting was just awesome. Everything just fit so perfectly in that scene. That's just, I was, I was like, had goosebumps, dude. Like at first, I had goosebumps when he walked in, and then when the fight was going on, even more. And I was just like, just like, holy crap, this is insane like literally i was just so hyped throughout the, that that this this episode like whoo man it was just crazy but yeah hey guys welcome back to another anime kingdom of you as you can see by the title below and for what i'm talking about this is on episode 12 of boku no hero academia it just there, there really isn't much to talk about just it's literally like this action, this episode, the fight in this one was just pure awesome. Of course, it starts off with everyone pretty much look like they're going to die. Here comes All Might, ah, like a badass coming in, rushes forward. Looks like he's in a bad situation with like the Shadow Guy and Nomu attacking him and just hurting him in his weak point. Plus, he barely has time in the first place. We already know that. That's why I was wondering, oh my gosh, is he going to be able to, you know stay in this form the whole time and even he said he barely has under a minute when um he did go end up fighting and everything which was just like oh okay so things might get really bad like real fast um still don't know where the hell the rest of the teachers are there's got to be a like some teacher that has some ability to instantly teleport them there or run fast fly fast something someone else should be there besides all might right i know he met you know Ida halfway, but still, Ida's fast. He should get there pretty damn fast and be able to tell like the teachers, hey, you gotta come and help, but that didn't happen. Though it was cool because we got to see Shoto, the ice guy, use some of his power. Um Byakugo, um just all like four of them. I forget the other guy's name, and Izuku obviously as well. Um all come to help fight. Looked like they were just, you know, they got the shadow guy under control. Looked like everything was going to good. Until that Nomu dude is just literally just invincible. His power, of course, is shock absorption. Shock absorption, sorry. So he could take everything, not everything, obviously. He can take like 100% of All Might's power. And when All Might, when like his eyes, the effect of his eyes, he's saying, I'm, you know, the symbol of peace. And then just like, and then like, boom, 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 boom. It was like some crazy ass fighting scene. Just like, it was so hyped hearing what he was talking about. Seeing Izuku you know like every hit it's not just wildly throwing out and even like it was just like pure awesome like the music as always just like played out just amazingly with the action scene the animations were on point with this scene like good job to the guys who animated this one because it was just like crazy good and seeing the intensity on all my face while he was just demolishing this guy and go beyond plus ultra and just flew him out the building into the sky into space pretty much it looked like and now hand guy and shadow guy or whatever are just like oh shit um that's scary hand guy over there he used a cheat <laughs> i mean it's pretty much it seems like he used a damn cheat code all might was just on fire he was crazy of course now you do see that he pretty much has run out of time and it looks like he's going to change back. Maybe he's hoping that they, you know, end up getting scared and leave. Obviously, that's not going to happen by the looks of it from the preview. It looks like we're going to get to see everyone else fight, which will be I'm excited to see because that's what I was hoping to see in this episode. Even though, like, I, I, I'm happy it didn't happen just for the fact that, holy crap, that fight between them was just pure insane. And pretty much All Might really is the only one that could have taken that guy down. Even... When he was like, hmm, at my prime, I could have taken down only five, but it took 300 hits. I was like, oh, 300 hits, yeah. Five hits, that's a huge difference. But obviously, he gave some of his power to Izuku. And, of course, before he got that injury, he's already hurt. He's about to change back, so it makes sense. But still, he is just, just, all might is just a beast of another level. Like, I, I can't wait to see Izuku at that kind of level. I, I, like, seriously, that's going to be pretty crazy, but... Yeah, I cannot wait to see the next episode because it looks like um, Izuku and the rest of them are going to be fighting together. Can't wait to see 
how that dynamic works against the two last villains hand guy who supposedly like when he touches you it just you like like what's it called Aizawa's skin was just like coming off like shattering off so I'm not too sure what his power really is um and of course shadow guy who can pretty much turn into a mist and everything and there's only that one weak point we've already seen that it's his is kind of easy to stop, so I don't know how it's going to work, but him with the other guy, like, teleporting through can be a problem, so I can't wait to see that. I'm wondering, is All Might going to change, like, right there in front of everyone? Is He, he can't just run away. Everyone's going to be like, what? He just left us? And I don't think they would let him change right there because everyone knows his secret after, right? So I'm, I'm really interested on how that's going to you know unfold as well will there be more teachers coming to help as well probably maybe at the very end because i don't know i kind of want teachers to come to see more powers of them but i want to see izuku and the rest of them use their powers work together and take down these villains because it would just be pure awesome to see them not these you know pr real pros and everything already but students taking down these guys who are like the top of the league of villains or whatever and i'm wondering is this league of villains is there more guys in there as well because it would be pretty interesting is this what we're going to see a recurring thing of the league of villains trying to attack them in the future that's another thing to be pretty interested in also like i said this is episode 12 so there's only one more episode left in the season hopefully that episode will conclude really well and just be crazy amazing like this one did and hopefully hopefully announces a second season because honestly this so far has just been pure amazing even if there's not a second season i'm going to read the manga because like literally this has just been pure just awesome like this episode literally i was at the edge of my seat just like whoa all might is a beast but yeah it's, guys that's really all i gotta say just another amazing episode definitely great suspense lean up to that ending part great action great music worked well the animation worked well the voice acting was on point everything was on point for this that fighting scene and just literally like i don't know how the next episode is going to top it because that was just pure awesome but if they can i honestly cannot wait to see how that episode is but yeah hope you guys enjoy this anime kingdom review if you have any questions feel free to comment below if there's anything i miss you to talk about comment below as well and yeah, until next time, guys, go beyond plus ultra. See ya.